morning from Berlin. My name is Ivana and I'm feeling so much better than yesterday. I don't know if I'll be able to eat a lot. I shouldn't probably because yesterday I got sick from eating too much. But uh, I think if I have a tea, I will be able to eat something. And we're off to the neighborhood Neukölln because you guys told me on Instagram that there's a shop with vegan donuts there. And I really want to see that and I hope I can try some if I feel good enough to eat. We're in Berlin to discover the local life, hashtag be local, with uh, the organization Wimdu. So yeah, let's go to Neukölln and see what vegan donuts look like. <laughs> Yes, <laughs> my German is perfect. I didn't even have Flammkuchen. Seriously, when you're in Germany, you need to have that. It's so good. Flammkuchen are, are like a very, very thin pizza crust, like super thin, so it becomes very, very crispy. And then with um, not with cream cheese, but more with uh, creme fraiche and all kinds of toppings. Oh. It's so good, it's delicious. Here we are, Brahmi Balls Donuts. Coffee, bagels, juices, winning in life. Let's go inside. Wow, 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 wow. Look at all of these vegan donuts. Oh my gosh, I am still nauseous. I don't know how I'm gonna eat this, but I need to have it, man. This is so adorable. Look at all those old school chairs. And I'm just sitting on a sofa. Feeling like I'm in someone's living room. I love it. Also, I got two donuts. They are humongous. Look at my hand. So this is the salted caramel one, and this is the smoked maple uh, coconut one. Also, I ordered ginger tea because I really need to soothe my stomach. I am still nauseous. No idea how I'm gonna eat these donuts. Maybe I'll just bring one with me. Yes, my my love for food is very, very deep. Dude, I just traveled 45 minutes to get vegan donuts. You have to understand my dedication to good food. So, um, I just hope if I get some tea, I'll be able to eat at least one donut and maybe take the other one just with me or something. I need to have it. I just need to have it. Yes, I know it's a problem. Don't judge me. I'm going to eat this one first. The smoked maple coconut donut. Let me just try the coconut on top. This is the strangest taste ever. It tastes like coconut bacon or something. This is so weird. Good but weird but good. But weird. So I have to confess, I already took a bite of the donut. Couldn't wait anymore. The donut is super fluffy. It's literally just fresh out of the oven. Oh my god. They are a little bit oily. But it's alright, I can handle. <laughs> but that, that coconut on top, that is the strangest taste ever. Good, but we are good, but we are good. Got the fresh ginger tea, look at this. Berlin, I love you, man. Like literally fresh ginger tea, no tea bags, nothing. Well, the ginger tea actually seems to be working. This is so good. My nauseousness is clearing up a little bit. Should I take a bite of the second donor? Yolo, let's just do it. This flavor is a little bit less odd. It's salted caramel. It's quite good, but I thought the other one was better because it's more, I don't know, more surprising. I never tasted smoked maple coconut. It was really, really good. And this one's also a lot more oily than the other one, but still, it's, it's good. I'm not complaining. It's super fluffy, but this one's definitely more oily than the other one. Look at this massive tray full of donuts. Who wants one? How badly do you want one? <laughs> 
Unfortunately, all good things come to an end. I have to get my stuff and get to the airport with Tat. She was still sleeping. Yes, I'm an early bird on Sunday when vegan donuts are involved. <laughs> Truly a must do, in my opinion, if you are in neighborhoods. I know that not everybody is as crazy as me to make a journey of 45 minutes to taste vegan donuts, but you know, that's my job. I have to test it out for you. So if you are in the neighborhood, Brami Ball, vegan cafe, and they have vegan donuts, try it. No call. It's in the neighborhood near Kong. If you're wondering how you're doing, well, I'm a little bit nauseous again from that second donut because it was so oily. But it's all right, it's all right. I'm, uh, I'm managing. If you're asking, was it worth it? Well, the smoked maple coconut one, definitely. That was a nice experience, but the salted caramel, car caramel, caramel one, mm, no. Try a different flavor. <laughs> Guess who made it to the airport on time? We made it. We made it. Do you want to tell them what, what you forgot or you don't want to talk about it? I lost my uh... Your debit card. She was buying the final metro ticket. Lost it in the machine. But I only had two hours of sleep, so I'm uh, Yeah. I'm it's not, okay. I'm not fully it's okay. awake. And it's it's like nobody died, so we're happy about that. We didn't miss a flight. It can be fixed. So, oh, by the way, I got burek. And if you have no idea, it's originally Turkish, but they also sell it in Yugoslavia. So it's dough with cheese and with spinach, and it is so delicious. So that's what I'm eating right now while everybody's boarding. And we're just taking it easy. Why does this not focus? Yes, there you go. Everybody's boarding. We're eating. Actually, I'm eating. Burek, seriously, so good. Mm. When I go back to my country, this is all I'll be eating. Mm. They have really good Turkish food in Germany. I wish we had that in the Netherlands. Mm. We have it, but it's yeah, but it's very hard to find. It's, it, like here, it's literally on every corner. You have really good Turkish food. Mm. When I came home, I literally slept for a couple of hours. Stefan can confirm. Right, baby? Just put your thumbs up. Yep, I did. I did. I slept for so long. I was so tired. I guess yesterday just wore me out. And now uh, Stefan got some food. So we have a veggie croquette over here. Oh, this one is so good. From Grizzle. The best. And also, a veggie burger. Eating this while watching fave guilty pleasure ever, the Dutch show Temptation Island or the Dutch version of Temptation Island. Oh, love it. Babe, I have a gift for you. There you go. <laughs> you have to open it. Open it. Look at that, custom made, custom made. <laughs> yeah, you dig it? <laughs> you want it? I want chocolate. <laughs> I've been feeding him chocolate for days, no joke. <laughs> it is 1.30 because I took a nap, I couldn't sleep earlier, but I'm gonna go to bed now. I really hope you guys enjoyed these Berlin vlogs, if you did, Put a thumbs up and if you would like to travel along to Morocco because that's going to be the next uh, travel vlog series, click that subscribe button and then I will see you next time. Bye!